the threat to abortion is no longer hypothetical. The consequences of this impending Supreme Court decision would be swift and they'd be devastating for communities nationwide, including here in Idaho, where should this draft become a ruling, our trigger ban would immediately go into effect, uh, effectively outlawing all abortion in the state of Idaho. Governor Little signed a law in 2020, including a trigger provision, making abortion a crime for the doctor performing the procedure should the U.S. Supreme Court overturn Roe v. Wade. These states have passed laws that act as a trigger that if Roe is overturned, uh, then immediately after it is overturned, these laws essentially banning abortion, uh, in some cases with exceptions for rape and incest, would uh, or the life of the mother would go into effect immediately. In 2021, an appeals court ruling on similar law in Texas nearly triggered Idaho's law, but it fell short. If Roe v. Wade is overturned at the federal level, abortion will once again be regulated on a state by state basis. And Idaho's trigger law would outlaw abortions immediately. This would be devastating for people in Idaho who are pregnant, for women, obviously, for other people who can become pregnant. I think it's important to name that the, the people this will affect the most will be, you know, people without means. Abortions in certain cases, such as incest, rape, or danger to the mother, would still be legal, but the amount of reproductive care in the state could drop significantly. Those Idahoans who uh, did wish to procure an abortion but who did not fit those criteria would have to travel far and wide to uh, to get that care. According to Planned Parenthood, someone seeking an abortion would have to travel an average of 250 miles to receive care. It's important to note the law is not overturned yet. This was a leaked majority opinion, right? And so the law has not changed. Roe is still the law of the land, at least until this opinion comes out. But once it does, immediately that law would would go into effect. Most recently, lawmakers look to limit access to abortion care in the state, passing the federal heartbeat bill this year, banning abortions after a heartbeat is detected that Governor Little signed into law. Nicole Camarda, Idaho News 6.